it's me and today I'm doing my fall tag. I'm so excited. I haven't done a tag in a long time. Like my goal was to do a tag every week, but then I wasn't even home man, so I couldn't do it. But I'm now home and I'm excited. First announcement is the first week of November is the makeup show. I hope you guys go. It's going to be in Orlando and you guys can see and you can pick up my new brushes and yay! So I'm excited. But I just wanted to throw that in there just in case you guys weren't able to get the link. It's below and it's going to be in Orlando. It's Sunday and Monday. So hopefully you guys can make it. It's professional only. So if you have your business card, you do makeup for others and they pay you, then you are qualified. So see if you have a business card out there. If not, then I'm really sorry. Um, you guys have to read the website. But anyway, today is my fall tags. Okay, so I put all the questions right here on my phone so that way I could answer them without staring like at a laptop. Okay, first question is what is my favorite fall lip product? So that's a really hard question. Everyone always goes deeper and darker for fall. I tend to like the sheer kind of colors because that's just like my favorite go-to because I feel like with dark colors it's high maintenance and so I don't really want to do that. So that doesn't become a favorite. But to my favorite, here we go. So a lot of you guys were asking, what did I have last week? It's my L'Oreal number 175. I love it. It's purple. It's not quite a fall color, but it's still really pretty. So you guys were asking about this one. So my favorite color are colors like this. This one right here is Color Reach Balm, and it's number 219. And I love it because it has that whole mauve-like color, but it's still kind of sheer. I hope I'm not like overload. Okay, so I just piled it on, but I really love the color, as you can see. It's kind of gives me a little lip color, but it's still very maroon, sheer. It's perfect. I love it. It is number 219, so hopefully you guys can pick that up. The next question is, here we go, my favorite fall nail polish. Okay, so my favorite new fall nail polish, I Instagrammed it. Follow me on Instagram because I have a whole bunch of fun pictures, random stuff. You guys can get to know me a little better, figure out my whole like bang situation here on Instagram. But my favorite one, Sally Hansen, it's this diamond strength no chip nail color in number 480 black diamonds. Because it's black, it just looks so cool on your nails, but then there's like this sparkle, like this silver flex to it. It's not quite glitter, but it's gorgeous. Three coats though, and it's like, oh, it's so sexy. I love this one, I totally recommend it. All right, the next question is my favorite Starbucks fall drink. Why is it Starbucks? Why not Coffee Bean or Seattle's Best? My favorite coffee is Seattle's Best Caramel Mocha. But since you're asking Starbucks, I love their Caramel Spiced Apple Cider or Caramel Apple Cider. So good. So I can make it at home, but it's really good when you're in there. Oh, it's so nice and warm. I don't really like pumpkin. It's kind of like a, I don't know, pumpkin food drinks, eh, not for me. Okay, my favorite fall candle. So I have this fear of flames, open flames and candles at the house. Like I do have it here and there, but I'm very paranoid. Uh, long story short, I knew somebody and flames not so good. So anyway, I love this Cupcake Scentsy. And what I do is, I sometimes buy the Scentsy scents, but Walmart has better homes and gardens kinds, and they're so strong and they're so amazing. This one right here is like a, I think it's like orange cream cupcake or something. It's so good. Oh my gosh. I don't even need to turn it on. I could just leave it and it just smells so good. So get the cute Scentsy Cupcake. And then my I got it from my friend. So I'll have her information below. You could support her. And you can get the actual wax stuff from Walmart. Better home than garden. Yes, love. Okay, my favorite fall accessory are scarves and boots. I know, you're like, you live in Southern California. It's okay, the second it drops to 80, I'm like, oh, it's so cold. Just so I could dress up. Anyway, my favorite scarf is my Hello Kitty scarf. I got this at Hot Topic. They have it in black and in white. I got this a couple months ago in the summertime, but I bought it anyway, and it was $16.50. So yeah, I love this. It's so cute. It's very understated Hello Kitty. Like, you know, it could get really crazy intense, but this is cute because it looks like a pattern. And if you know Hello Kitty, you know it's Hello Kitty. So I really like it. The next question, Haunted House, Haunted Hayride, or Haunted Corn Maze? Can I say none of the above? I'm like a big chicken. I'm not into Not Scary Farm or any of that stuff. I would probably just pass on all that. I just don't like scary stuff. 
it it doesn't make me feel good. I don't like anything that gives me anxiety. I like to sleep at night. I like happy. So I'm just like, no, it's okay. It's okay, I'll pass. My favorite Halloween movie, um, I'm gonna cheat and say I love The Great Pumpkin, The Peanuts, you know, like Charlie Brown and all of them and Snoopy. I love that kind of Halloween, happy, upbeat stuff. And so that would be my favorite. Let's see, are you dressing up for Halloween? If I show my butt and boobs, does it count? That's a Halloween costume, right? Because that's what I, I learned. Actually, I don't think I'm gonna be dressing up this year and that's why I haven't done any videos or anything because I've been super busy like trying to prepare for the show in Florida. And it just really sucks because it's hard to do all of that and do a Halloween video because I want to do like creative stuff. But I'm sure you guys can see tons and tons of great videos online. But I'm gonna do holiday stuff for sure because that's one of my favorites. That's what makes me a little happier, a little happy, upbeat kind of thing. Halloween's kind of yeah, ghosts and kind of me. I don't know. So that's my feeling. It's me. I don't know. <laughs> All right. So let's see. The next question is, what is your favorite thing about fall? My favorite thing about fall are the leaves that change and the weather dips just a little bit here. Where I live, ranges the weather doesn't really range too much. So. I like the change in clothes, I love tights, I love boots, I love dresses, I love that it's not too cold where I can still wear. I love that I can still wear like summery outfits while still wearing like the fall outfits. So I love that and I love the, just the way everything smells, you know, there's like pumpkins and Thanksgiving and just kind of all the holidays that are coming up. So that's what I love about fall. Yee! Okay you guys, that is my tag video. I'm so excited I did a tag video this week. So. You guys are going to be all tagged. I want to also invite some of my friends to do this tag. I don't know if they have time though, but Encore Makeup, who hasn't done a video in like 12 years, and Charisma Star, and Chelsea, and also, who else? Well, I want to tag you guys for sure. I want you guys, I want you guys to do a tag video and do a video response. And just for funsies, I will do a giveaway for these red lips. This is like sold out. I don't have anything left except for these pink ones at my store. You can go to my store and check it out. And it's elisaj.com. So what I'll do is I will do a giveaway. All you guys have to do is tag the video and then name it I Heart Fall Tag and then like a video response to Perspez. And like the video, do a tag and good luck. I will pick a random winner and I will pick and let you guys know who that is next week. Oh, also, just like a side note, a lot of you guys were asking about my hair color. Okay, so I did an Instagram. Hope you guys are following me. This is a clip-on bang thing that I had. I don't know if you guys remember it from when I lived in, I don't know, it was like probably 2008 or nine, and I had this. But now that it's old and it's not as shiny, it looks a lot more natural. But yeah, it's a Jessica Simpson one, I don't know. I don't know how real it looks, it looks kind of ink, like right here, you should probably wear like a headband. But my hair color is actually like J.Lo. I literally looked for a picture of J.Lo that I loved, and I said I want this color. And then this lady that I've never gone to did my hair, and I think she processed it twice, so I don't know if you guys, some of you guys aren't okay with that. But my hair's bounced back, it's fine. And she's in Tustin, and she's not like a hoity-toity place I was recommended because of her like how well she does. So I don't want to like recommend her, but you guys are expecting some way to place. Hers is like very humble. It's very, you know, they do hair and nails and that's it. So if you guys are interested, I'll have her information below. And that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you guys later. Bye.